Scoring is now complete. Horses and the drivers for this evening's ninth race. The Des Smith Classic are moving in behind the starting gate. One is Boson's mate scoring from post two. One A, part of the entry. Day in the Life will score from post seven. Number two is Noble Ability scoring from post one. Three is Red Bowtie from post three. The four is Knightswood from four. Number five is Admiral's Express scoring from five. Number six is Logtex scoring from post six. And Goliath Bayam of the seven horse will score from the outside post position number eight. Horses and the drivers for the 19th edition of the Des Smith Classic on the wings into the backstretch. This field is now in motion, and there they go. They're off and pacing from the far outside of the racetrack. Uh, Admirals Express. Admirals Express going hard now for the lead. Down on the inside and quickly shutting that decision down is Red Bowtie. And Luke Willette pushes now hard for the lead, takes charge quickly after an eighth of the mile. Admirals Express caught on the outside now, looks for a spot as they make their way to the opening quarter. Down on the rim in third, off that turn is Noble Ability. Off the turn, and they move past that quarter with red bow tie length in front. 26 and 2, searing opening panel now as they move in front of the grandstand. Up front with the lead by a length and a half is red bow tie. Down on the inside, that is noble ability in the pocket. Admirals Express caught on the outside and left out third towards the rail in fourth as they head towards the half. That is day in a life. On the move now, starting up fifth on the outside is Goliath Bayama. He picks up cover as they move around that turn. Towards the inside, Bosons made us in sixth. In uh, seventh up the rail, shuffled back is Log Tex. The half reached 54 and two fifths seconds. They continue up the back stretch, approaching three quarters and driving up on the outside. Now to challenge as they move down the back stretch. Part of the entry, Day in a Life clears by three parts of a length. Towards the rail, that is Red Boat Tie. And uh, locked in with nowhere to go. That's Noble Ability. In between pacers shaking loose. Bosons made us found some racing room. Three quarters. 122 flat on the final turn. Day in the life is open to two and a half lengths. Up in the far outside part of the entry, both sons mate trying to get there with them. Down on the inside, Red Boat Tie clinging third. Up the rail in fourth, Noble Ability, and they straighten out for home. Through the lane, Day in the Life opening up by four. Both sons mate far outside. Red Boat Tie's found a little bit more. The Catman sneaks through with Noble Ability. Here's the finish, here's the wire. Day in the Life, 149 and four. Track record. Here they are. Track record in world record fashion, 149 and four fifths seconds. The winner. Yes, and uh, Chris Christopher has won a lot of races in his lifetime, and uh, it's been a long time since I've seen him this excited. Uh, he made the uh, the flight to Rito Carlton Raceway. It's his third winner of the night, but 149 and four is uh, something that he'll remember for a long, long time with Day in a Life. And uh, let's not forget to congratulate Mark Stacy. Mark Stacy is the uh, the one that broke and trained this colt, and he made his first steps here at Rito Carlton Raceway. His first two lifetime races were here, and uh, it's great to see him with, win the Des Smith. Now returning in front of the grandstand, the world record holder for a 5 8 mile racetrack, Day in a Life. Owned by Perfect World Enterprises, Nat Vardy trains the son of life sign, life sign Chris Christopheru, the winning driver tonight. It's the fourth trip to the winner's circle in 19 starts this season for Day in a Life. The mile and one, 49 and four fifths seconds. Once again, track record, world record performance on a 5 8 mile track this evening here at Rideau Carlton Raceway. And in the winner's circle, once again making the presentation of the Des Smith Classic, the 19th. Des Smith Classic is Mrs. Eileen Smith, joined by Max Keeping. Once again, congratulations to the connections, the Perfect World Enterprises from Old Westbury, New York, and uh, Ontario Jockey Club trainer Nat Devardi, and of course, uh, a man that's held a hot hand for uh, over the last 24 months uh, throughout Canada, Jockey Club, Flamborough Downs, uh, south of the border, when he tra uh, makes his way down to New Jersey and the Meadowlands and just about anywhere, Chris Christopheru is making a name for himself in this sport, and congratulations. Uh, Greek Junior, way to go, and uh, come on back next year and see if you can do it again.
John McMillan trackside with Chris Christopher. Chris, congratulations. What a brilliant mile. Thanks a lot. Yeah, he, uh, he just showed his class today. He raced super and, uh, you know, world record over uh, Rito Carlton. I think it's, it's nice for the community, especially since the horses, you know, he was trained down here and, and, and broke down uh, or broke the race here. And uh, it's just really nice for, for the community. And Perfect World Enterprises, the owners, and uh, Nat Vardy, the trainer. Talk a bit about these connections. Well, I, I kind of hooked up with these guys about, uh, be going all close to about, I'd say, a year now, and uh, had nothing but luck with them. The first time I drove for them, I drove a horse in the Breeders' Crown, and he won. So, I mean, it's just been a, a heck of a ride for me, and uh, I can't say enough about Nat Vardy. He's uh, definitely one of the, the best uh, young trainers in the sport today. When you picked up a program and looked at your competition tonight, did you feel you had a shot to win one, and did you feel you had a shot at the world record, too? Um, as far as the world record went, I, I knew it would have to be a really, really fast pace in front of me. And, uh, you know, you never know what's going to happen as far as that goes. But I thought in order to, to really have a chance in here, I couldn't get too far back. And we got real lucky leaving out of there. Was a, there was a hole going into the first turn, and we backed into it. So you got to be lucky in this game, and we were tonight. Chris, you got to be lucky, and you got to be good. And good you are. Three winners tonight at Rideau Carlton, and this one was absolutely amazing. Eyes of North America were on us tonight. We were on TRN, uh, satellite broadcast all across North America. We're on Sports Radio 1200, the team here in Ottawa. Thank you so much for coming to Rito Carlton Raceway. You're a fan favorite, and you put on a tremendous show tonight. Thanks a lot. Uh, it was great being here, and I hope I can come back real soon. Look forward to seeing you. Chris Christopher, winning driver. Let's have a round of applause for Chris. Brilliant drive, 149-4, world record on a 5 track.